Hello everyone, Mark here, Mark's Max Muscle, and today we are going to shine the spotlight on Andreas Munzer. And before I begin this one, today's episode, or today's video, is brought to you by Photoshop Freelance. Go ahead and follow him on Instagram, he is fantastic. Jeez Louise, I could do commercials for the, with this voice. Anyway guys, with all due seriousness... Superset man, hello Superset Maniacs, he's been doing videos of this nature as well. Now, what are we going to do? Well, Andreas Munzer, he looks pretty darn good, right? Well, compared to a mass monster, like say, Roly Winkler? Well, he still looks good, but he, he lacks a lot of size. So today, we're going to go through some photos of Andreas Munzer, and boom, we're going to beef him up. Because he is so striated, and he is so conditioned, that with some added size, I think he could defeat almost anybody. Well, is he defeating Roly Winkler here? Well, it's, it's pretty close. I think Andreas needs, boom, some more beef. What do you guys think? And now I would say, it's a safe bet that with all this added beef, Andreas Munzer could probably defeat anybody. I mean, look guys, his triceps just as big, more striated. So he's defeating Roly Winkler in a hoo-ha pose, for goodness sakes. So, we will take a look at several more poses, but I do believe that after this, we should have a video with the enhanced Andreas Munzer versus a, a modern-day competitor. Now here is a most muscular, for goodness sakes, and he looks awesome, as is Andreas Munzer. Some of the most underrated wheels bodybuilding history. Look at the feathering in those quads. Reminiscent of a Kai Green. And Kai, to be honest with you, this is a this is an older version of Kai. He's probably even losing this comparison. But still, when you look at the arm department, Kai's a bigger man. Now, beef Andreas up, and he's beating up Kai Green. Look at this, guys. Of course, to be fair, to defeat Kai Green properly... You need a big midsection, like Phil Heath would tell you. And now he's really defeating Kai Green, the bigger midsection. But anyway, anyway, all seriousness. This here, Andreas Munzer, big midsection, or go back to the small midsection. He really would be a handful, I think. And dare I say, might even be top three. Might even win the Olympia. Here's another most muscular. And I'm just going to run through these poses. I'm not going to do too many comparisons because... Like I said, I would like to do an entire comparison against somebody. Boom. Look at that, guys. Look at that. I like I like when Superset Man, he does these type of videos, and he does the same thing. He says, boom. See, that time his midsection boomed out. But I still think he looks good. Look at the size of this Hostetler, Andreas Munzer. Anyway, guys, run through some poses, and this is as is. Much like all the poses. One of his best. This is unbelievable, this front lat spread. And, okay, okay, okay. I will do a comparison against, you know who, Dorian Yates. And this isn't like I'm ripping Kai Green off last time. This is a prime Dorian Yates. And he is winning. He is defeating Andreas Munzer. Andreas, very good in the muscle separation, though. You see that? Probably winning in the wheels as well. Food for thought. Let's beef him up. Oh my goodness, oh my soul. Dorian's still very Dorian-esque in those lats. But I think Andreas with the dominance of the wheels, more like a modern-day competitor. And the lats were filled out a little bit more in the uh, in the comparison that uh, Photoshop Freelancer hooked me up with. And dare I say, guys, and I know I hate to ruffle any feathers of Dorianites, but might even... Oh, okay, he'll match Dorian. I'm not going to say he's beating him. But he probably, or he is, be defeating Porter Cottrell. He's be defeating him anyway, even with this. It looks like an enhanced version, Andreas. Now, boom, look at that. This is an unbelievable front lat spread. Now he's really defeating Porter Cottrell. Not that he wasn't before, but dare I say he would defeat any modern day competitor as well unbelievable here's a weak pose for andreas if you ask me in my opinion that is when you do look at up and down all his poses the front double by 
Probably not his strongest. Now, boom. Look at that. Now he's ready to hit the town. Now he is ready to enter a 2021 bodybuilding stage. He could win the Indy Pro. He could go right in with this physique. He could, guys. This is Andreas Munzer. Remember the conditioning that he possesses. Anyway, guys, you have to be fair, and he might have some Palumboism. He might have a distended midsection. But this is a fantasy video. I'd like to think that he would look like this. So anyway, guys, I, I at least I showed one picture of the, the Palumboism. But anyway, let us have a look at least at one back shot. And keep in mind, this was 94, I believe. And they did not even flex their glutes. But trust me, if he did, he would be strided because look at his hamstrings, guys. Look at his lower back. Look at the conditioning that he was in. But, I mean, look at Dorian Yates there at this Olympia and prior. They just did not do that. But anyway, guys, this was a very competitive rear double buy. But if you add some size, I think he would have defeated anybody back then. Would he have defeated anybody today? Well, I don't know. They are very big nowadays, guys. So we may have to throw on... Let's throw on another 20 pounds. Here's a 260-pound Andreas Munzer. I don't think Andreas was very heavy, mind you. Maybe this is a 280-pound Andreas Munzer. Look at how just massive and impressive he is. Can't wait to do a comparison between Andreas. You guys should uh, let me know in the comment section below. Who should he face? I'll go for the one with the most thumbs up. There's a few popular ones. Maybe I'll do a poll. Maybe I'll do a poll. I just hope you guys like Andreas Munzer as much as I do. I mean, let's face it, guys. Even without the photoshops, this guy was... Just raw, striated beef, lacking a little bit of size. So when you throw that size on, who could defeat this man? And like I said, I do have a few more poses up my sleeve that Photoshop freelancer did send me. So I will be saving them for the comparison. But this most muscular, you see that? Like I said, he looks impressive anyway. Not an ounce of fluid or anything on him. Now throw on the beef. Oh my goodness. This is just unbelievable. I feel bad for the person that you guys want to see go up against. This juiced up, this jacked up, mass monster Andreas Munzer. An enhanced Andreas Munzer. All he was missing is size. He has it now with this fantasy video. Anyway, guys, hit thumbs up on this one if you did enjoy it. Remember, this was just for fun. And it was, in my opinion. Subscribe to the channel. Have a great day.